Seven on five here, people. Yay. It's ridiculous. What's up, people? Salty McFly. We hit you with a cut. Come. It's been a long time. I haven't uploaded in a little bit. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Where do you go? So there's something I want to talk about, something that is honestly making me a little nervous about this new Call of Duty remaster coming out with Infinite Warfare. There's already videos coming out about it, and I don't like it at all. It's People don't understand that Call of Duty 4 was a different game from a different time. We've had this conversation in the hive. I mean, Flank gone back and forth a little bit about it. Flank's a good guy. Check out his channel. It's blowing up right now. Oh, no. Don't snipe me. So people are already making videos about what needs to change with Call of Duty 4. That's a kill. What do you mean? What, how? Like The game has not come out yet. And people are already saying this has to happen. This needs to happen. And I, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Call of Duty 4 came out in 2007. In 2007, YouTube right now as you know it was not like this at all. Oh, you could look up some stuff about Call of Duty and things like that, but this whole commentary thing, people putting up videos about this gun and that gun and this thing and that thing and all that stuff like that, that wasn't that wasn't a thing. This gun is overpowered. This gun is unbalanced. This perk needs to change. This has to be addressed and different things. That was not part of YouTube. The game was what it was, and that was it. People are so used to people fixing things and this, that, and the other. Oh, there's a glitch. How is this glitch? It's been out for a week. People are making videos. Why haven't they fixed this yet? There are glitches in Call of Duty 4 that to this day are still in there. People are still getting out of the map the same exact way. They're going up the stairs. They're laying down. They're shifting, jiving around the side, popping up, going around, jumping on the roof. That's how Call of Duty 4 is, okay? That's how the game was. I know it doesn't fly the way people are now, but guess what? It was from a different time, a different era. The game was what it was. When growing up, when I was a kid, and when you bought a game, the game was what it was. That's it. If you didn't like something and you were split screening with your friends, your cousins, your family, whatever the situation was, you can make rules yourself. I brought this up before, the GoldenEye rules. I got sniped. You know, no golden gun. You pick up the golden gun, you get what will eat, son. That's it. If you get the golden gun, you get a what will eat and an Indian burn. That's probably racist now. But that's how, I don't know what they call it now. That's what we used to call it. Call of Duty was the way it was because it was just a great game. The, com the, the community that people like to call a Call of Duty community was not a thing back then. There was no Call of Duty community. It was just the people who enjoyed playing the game played the game. Frag times three was in the game. Goat liquor. Dude, don't like frag times three, but guess what? I like frag times three. You know why? Because you didn't have to survive to get 27 kills to get your mothership and TDM or whatever the hell it is. Do you know what the highest kill streak was in Call of Duty 4? Seven. Seven. Seven kills, and you got your helicopter, and that was it. And your kill streaks did not roll over. Once you got that seven, that was it. You can keep going and get you get more kills, but you weren't getting another UAV. You weren't getting another anything. So when you got your seven kills, you almost wanted to die. So you can start over and get your freaking kills again. Get your streaks again. How you doing, bro? I'm worried about the game coming out and having so much backlash from people who want the game to be like the new game, even though they don't like the new games, they like the old yeah. games better, but by them complaining about certain stuff, with certain guns and certain things, they're gonna turn the old game into the new game with how things play, and like, it, it doesn't make any sense to me at all. If they put out this remastered version and all they do is upgrade the graphics, then they should leave it like that. They shouldn't go back in and do weapon balancing and different things like that. People need to stop treating treating this old Call of Duty as a new Call of Duty. Stop making videos about balancing this, that, and the other. This has to change. Whatever the situation. Like, I Stop doing that. Because you're just going to make the game shitty. That's how it is. You're going to make the game shitty. What up, Rocky? I want to see certain maps come back. I want to see shipment come back. I want the chaos back. I want the frag times three. Every two seconds, you're getting blown up. You're getting shot. It was chaos. That's how Call of Duty was. People who play the game now so slow and strategically 
they're gonna get a rude awakening playing the old Call of Duty because that's not how Call of Duty was made. Call of Duty was a run and gun game, and that's how it was, and that's what I loved about Call of Duty. That's why I play the way I play. I don't freaking sit and camp. I don't care if I get my freaking streaks or not. I'll get upset when I get close that I don't get them, but that's part of the game for me. You know? That's part of the game. For some people, they can't do that. They have to get their streaks. They have to do this. They have to do that to be good and to have a good time. I, I'm not like that. I think that's because I played the old Call of Duties. Look at, look, look, at, look, at, look, at, look, at, look at this guy, son. Look at you freaking hopscotching, bro. That's it. That's what I'm worried about. Solid McLeod. Goat liquor. Look at goat liquor, son. That's just some awkward stuff, son. That's some barnyard. Hey, how you doing over there? You got a pretty mouth type of stuff. Goat liquor. Come on, bro.